let's look in and see what's on Biden's mind concerning the 2020 run. Is he considering it? Hmm. I know I would love to see him run, but let's see what he's got going with that. Is he considering it? I think he would be one of the best nominees to run. Very level-headed. Let's see what we have. Is he considering it? I kind of sit with this a second. Okay. What I got the first card, I was like, hmm, what does this mean? Okay, and it took me a few things to look at what's going on with this. But what I got was, you know, that things are really out in the cold. Now, I was like, what is this referring to? Then we had the chariot, okay? Things are ra rapidly moving. And I think what's out in the cold is not him, but just the United States with all the Trump stuff. Because we got the chariot that's going quickly, and then we have, we need a strong, we need somebody in there with strength to guide the country. Now, the reason I say that, because what I have next, going into it, which is the Knight of Swords coming against the Trump, the Trump enclave, okay, that they're getting taken down. So we are really, and here we have Mueller coming forward here, like a ghost to just really whipping in um, to take down Trump and his holdings and all of that. So basically the country is in turmoil. And he's seeing that they're out, you know, since we're out in the cold and all this stuff, and they really need somebody strong at the helm, okay? What's underneath of it is he's got this emotional thing going, and uh, also with that is a sort of peace, that we really need to have somebody that can bring peace, that can bring uh, stabilization, that can bring some stability back to the country, okay? And he's looking at it, and he's uh, above it here. Even though it's the card of illusion, I say he's got no illusions about the mess that's there that needs to be, you know, when Trump is gone, it's a, it's a big nightmare of a lot of things that need to be handled. And he's looking and seeing, you know, really the night, we've got the night of discs. You know, is he ready really to take this on? Is he really ready to take this on? Because it's really a lot of stuff that's coming up. Okay. Um, let me see. Yeah, I would say, just looking at, you know, the country needs to come to balance. Um, 
internally, Princess of Wands. Now, when I see that, sometimes I see the princess as internal energy. He's And the fact that we have also the hermit, He's I think he's soul searching to really see if he's got the energy to do this, to bring everything into balance. So it's looking right now like he is really soul searching to find out if he's got the the wherewithal to to take this on um yeah because things need to move forward things need to move forward and yeah because again here we have uh muller again you know that there's gonna be some big changes coming and you know whoever takes this on is going to be feeling beat up i mean it's it's not going to be easy Okay, because again, the Trump enclave, everything is coming down. And oh, that one just jumped out at me. And it's a big burden. It's a big burden for whoever comes in next to take over. They're going to have to fight some battles. You know, they're going to have to fight some battles. And again, bring a new new message a new um it's like starting over there's so much to be done in the world it's like starting from scratch again there's a lot of judgment happening a lot of uh a lot of drama and it needs to be somebody that's temperate that can really kind of stabilize things um and it's going to take he has no uh illusions it's going to take a lot of work a lot of things need to be cultivated in order to do that, okay? And again, it's like, at this point, trying to look and see what all is needed to go forward. It's like, I don't want to see it. Oh, my God. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want <laughs> Can't say I blame him because it's a lot. Yeah, but he knows that, you know, again, justice is coming needs to be done and uh again we need to uh it's going to take a lot of energy it's going to take somebody that really can get in there that can motivate people that can connect people that can give and when i see the lovers with him you know i see it as being wanting to connect people to bring a gentler message to bring people together again in a different consciousness than what was there and again he needs you have to have somebody with a big club you know that's really dynamic that's got yeah and has the emotional fortitude to do it um yeah to take over the the reins of 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 the kingdom so to speak so he's considering it but like i said it's a real soul searching because it's he knows that whoever comes in it's a lot to take on he's not a young man anymore okay and uh i think he would be a great stabilizing influence but i think really he's he's looking to see if he's got enough energy to to do this if he's got enough enough wherewithal that he could um that he could uh give everything that's needed for this that's all i just see him doing a lot of soul searching but he would be really i think he would be really really good for the country um but again it's up to him everyone's got free will it's he he's got a soul search and see if it's what he wants to take on and nobody can make that choice other than him. If he if he's ready, if he's got the energy to do it, you know, so we'll see. But he's considering it very, very deeply, like I said, soul searching. He's really delving within himself to see if he's got the wherewithal to handle this. So I will leave that there. Let's hope that he finds enough fortitude to go forward because i think he would be a great choice so onward and upward thank you for the question